should mute it. Alright, we're watching the demo of me on Castle. I did this for uh, a mission. And I just solo queued this, so I'm gonna probably show you the highlights. I don't know how that works though. It's shift F2. So let's go the first round. So this is me, during Bleach, the best name in Counter-Strike, I just think it's funny. Cause I was playing the other day, and this kid was really mad at me. He was like, why don't you go drink some Bleach, you fucking nobody? I was like, okay, I'm gonna go do that. And then I asked him, what flavor of Bleach would you recommend? Clorox? And like, he just got so mad, so I made up my name. I find on Castle, uh, this is a good spot. Like, I can't hit anything, I'm so bad. Got lucky there. I pushed up. I should have just played at the stairs. Got another headshot. Getting lucky. See, this is me not being patient. Ah, oh, I can't aim. See, my teammate's gonna make it happen. Bombs down. See, this is what I like playing. I was AK level. Yeah, it's just interesting to play. It's kind of hard, like, especially solo queuing, to have people who are, like, good or want to, like, follow directions. It's kind of hard sometimes. Why am I following this kid? Let's follow me. My bad. There we go. I actually ranked up this match, as a matter of fact. I'm really bad at Counter-Strike. I think my biggest problem with Counter-Strike is, in my opinion, you have to play a lot. And you have to play a lot and have to have a good team to play with. And just play smart and this game is very frustrating because I'll have games where I'll play really good and I'll have games that I'll play really terrible and it's very frustrating for me to play this game sometimes because sometimes I'll play really well and other times I'll play just terrible I'm talking bottom fragging and like it's frustrating for me to play you know with anything I think it's just the more you play the better you get I was doing this for that um, the breakout mission. That's why I was playing the castle. And I also changed my crosshair. I like the um, the crosshair that opens and closes because I know like my shot's gonna be inaccurate. So I want my cross. See when it's closed, I'm standing still. And when I move, it opens up. So I know when I spray, it's gonna be really bad. There's just one guy left, and I was like, bombs over there. Where's he at? I thought he maybe flanked the other way. Also, I find myself liking the M4 um, Silence a lot more than um, the other gun. Just because I think it's way more accurate. It's it's I like the M4A4 for spraying, and it's actually good if you're if you have really bad aim, because it has more bullets. But if you have good aim, I feel like it's really I think I get raped right here. If I remember right. I think he saw me. Two bullets on reload. I think the stairs right there is a really good spot to play because that seems to be a really common rush uh, spot. You just gotta play it right. My teammate, see, single AK, your teammates will shoot at you. This kid's AFK. Look, I can't even hit that. It's bad. One thing I think it's been helping me get a little bit better is uh, the radar. Like, seeing where people are dying on the radar and paying more attention to the minimap. I think helps me become a little bit better at the game. But I have a problem with my aim. My aim is just not very good. I've been definitely trying to get more headshots though. Like my headshot percentage is actually really good right now. 80% headshot. Which is not bad for a 5-3 and 1. But a lot of my assists should be kills. Because it's me just not following up. Not finishing my shots when I need to finish them. So that's one thing I need to work on. I mean I feel like Counter Strike is just... I don't really play that much. I don't, have the, I don't have that many hours. I maybe play like, I don't know, in two weeks, like 
maybe 12 hours, like an hour, an hour every two days, maybe two hours every two or three days. You know, not like a, a full-time streamer or, you know, putting full-time effort into the game. But I mean, as you can tell, there's no one over here and I'm checking all the points and spots. I'm the only one, I'm only one playing A and my team just lost uh, B. See if I clutch this. I don't even remember if I clutch this or not. Probably not. I'm really bad about clutch situations too. I find that um oh well, nice. I just don't do it sometimes. I think I remember this. The bomb was down and I didn't know where the guy was at. See, so I keep looking outside, I keep kind of checking the bomb to make sure it's there. Because I know I have 30 seconds left and I didn't know where the guy was at. I always have a hard time in these situations, like, because I really don't know what to do. You know, I don't, I probably should have actually played on the left where I'm aiming right there against the wall. And I, I barely get lucky spraying him, you know. So I was able to clutch it. Which is pretty rare for me because I'm pretty bad at the game. See, I tell him drink bleach every day. I'm always playing the A-Rush, but as you see on the mini-map, there's no one there. So I push the smoke like a noob. And I pay the price. I'm gonna speed it up a little bit. Ooh, I'm such a noob with the auto sniper. Look how bad this is. This is another thing I have a really hard problem with. When I see a lot of people rushing, I get nervous. See, and I missed all my shots. Every single shot I missed. That's terrible. With the auto, I should have at least got one kill there. And I know they're going to plant, so I'm going to play the angle. Look, I missed every shot there. That's so bad. Spray. Okay, I got one. I know bomb's down, but I don't know where the last guy is at. I think I get wrecked right here. I check the corner, I go inside. I'm just gonna play the corner. I know that it's it's four on two, so I'm calling to my team like bombs A, bombs A. There's another thing I have a hard time with the solo queuing. It seems it's really hard to get a uh, teamwork when you solo queue. It's it's just not something that's gonna happen. Let's speed it up. So I'm just watching angles. Check angle, check angle, check angles. I think they saved. Yeah, they end up saving. I got VIP that round, lucky me. Again, I push up. They call it speed. I, they have a guy that keeps his, if I remember right, I think his ping was really bad. If I remember correctly, this kid had really bad ping. Oh, maybe not. He, was, I think he was having a lag issue, so he was AFK sometimes, this kid. And these poor kids were not very good, if I remember right. But I mean, that's what you get when you solo queue. You're not always going to get the best players in the world. Right, I'm going to speed it up, because they're obviously not going this way. I'm playing the same spot every time, too, pretty much. So I'm going to push the smoke. I get a kill, free kill on the AFK kid. My teammate walked right past and didn't even kill him. That was... That was frustrating. I remember yelling at this kid. I'm like, what are you doing? He's in spawn, you know? 
This game, like, it gets very frustrating for me. I'm just not good at it. Oh, I ended up getting the kill there. He was camping. So I know he killed my teammate, I know he's there, so I'm just gonna play the corner and wait for him. Ended up getting the kill. Auto sniper, what a noob, I know. Such a noob. My wall hacks obviously told me there was a guy there, so I threw a grenade, as you see. And I'm watching a corner and no one's there. Speed it up, so what am I doing? I'm walking, walking, walking. I heard it's B. This is what's funny to me, look, this guy walked all the way to A. This is why, like, I don't know, look, he's way over here. I'm assuming, he, look, he wraps back in. I hear him right here, I hear him running. So I was waiting at the corner. And I see him, I was like, oh, I need to get a shot. And I get the auto sniper noob. Auto sniper noob, I know. Best noob, NA. I changed my spot because I was playing the same spot all the time, so I went over here just to change it up. And of course they push B. I don't think I do anything this round. Alright, next round. So I smoke it off. I have my auto ready. I see one. Two. And I got wrecked with the scout, headshot it. That was a really good shot from that kid. Really good shot. We're already up 10 nothing. I think we needed 16 rounds. And our team ended up defusing. So I buy the auto again because I'm a noob. But I pushed up uh, mid this time out because I w they called B. So just me left. I don't think I clutch this. I don't know. Let's find out. It's three on one. I think I go for it. So I see the guy there. Try spamming from the wall. I don't even know if that's spammable or not. I get the one with the with the pistol. I know the bomb's ticking. I do have a kit, but I only have 21 health. And I get wrecked. So I'm not clutch. I'm not a clutch player. I'm just bad. Alright. Next round, what happens? Again, I have the auto sniper because I'm a noob. But I push up this time. So they had a decoy, so I'm like, I'm gonna try to flank. Again, it's two on four. I know that the bomb's in B. I think I save. I miss the easiest shot in the world. You get one pick. I wonder if that grenade did any damage. No, it didn't. Deploying flashbang. Deploying flashbang. See, that was stupid again. I peeked with my whole body right there. I should have just peeked the corner. I play really dumb. Like, when I rewatch my games, I see so many mistakes I make. And I think that's why I get really frustrated with Counter Strike. It's because, like, I know how to play and I know what to do, but I seem to never do it correctly. And I think I, I get more frustrated in myself because it's really on myself that I'm not playing well, you know. And a lot of games I end up losing, I know it's because of me or, you know, a lot of mistakes I make. And again, I'm pushing A with auto sniper because I'm a noob. I think I get lucky though because I end up pushing where they're at. See, I see one over here. Let's see if I get another one. And I get the bomb carry, I get lucky. Alright, next round. Let's go. 
I play the exact same way every time. I probably should change it up. It's pretty predictable. So this guy's gonna get wrecked because he's right there. I wonder if he pushes. No. I'm watching the smoke. I don't know why. See, this is stupid. Because I should have realized that my teammate pushed here. This guy's bad because he had an easy kill on me. I didn't even see him. But I should have realized my teammate pushed, so he had to be either here. I shouldn't have been checking this. It's another one of my many mistakes I make all the time. So again, I get a lucky kill because I'm an auto sniping noob. It's 12 to 2. We're, we're up by a lot. This is uh, the last round of the half, so I definitely need to go for it. So I think I flash in. Check the hay bale. My teammate gets the kill, I get the defuse. And this is where I had a really hard time. I remember this game. My teammate weren't, weren't listening to me. I'm like, let's all go here. And I'm the first one out, and they're way behind. I remember this kid here. I get a lucky first kill on him. Bomb plant. Look, the whole team has to rotate, because they only played one guy on A. And I think I was waiting for the push. But they never end up pushing my direction. Again, this is my first time. This is my second time I took the back playing Castle. So Castle's a pretty new map, and my team's. See, I checked the, the corner right there. I didn't even know anyone was there. I'm not even aiming right now. I'm reloading in the open. That's. I mean, that's just bad play. It's just not smart. So don't do what I did there. I should have waited at the corner and just peeked the corner instead of just pushed out like that. This is stupid. So again, I call for my whole team to, to play A because I think taking A is really easy. I, it almost guarantees a bomb plan as long as you get an opening pick. Because people either play in this corner, here, or they'll play on the stairs. So I check the corners, of course, and there's no one there. I don't have the bomb, so I pushed up. And I tell them to get the bomb plan down so we at least get money because we're ecoing. This kid bought a Pro 90 because, you know, he's the best player in the world. And this kid bought a dry season. This is an interesting buy. Again, I think it's just because it's a single AK level. I'm kind of baiting my team. I'm watching the flank, but my teammates right here, you know, I should not. We don't both need to watch it. And now they're going to be defusing because the whole team's dead. Again, I peek with my whole body there like a dumbass. And then we lose. You know? Oh, I don't think they had time to. Oh, they defused. Okay. So we're playing really bad. I'm like, let's go B. Give B a shot on our first buy round. So this guy has an auto sniper, which is really smart for playing that position on well. And I get raked, of course. He's just auto sniping from well, and everyone's pushing in one at a time. It's just, you know, stupid. So we lose that round, obviously. See, so we're we're kind of letting them take over a CT. I buy a Pro 90 because I'm bad. I spray the, this first kid rushing. And I reload with 14 bullets because I'm bad. I think I try to push mid. I don't remember. So I, see, so I bait my teammate with the bomb. The bomb goes out first. I see the kid. He gets picked. Reload again with tons of ammo because I'm bad. Pick up a newbie gun because I'm bad. That guy gets one, one digged. I get the lucky spray. All right, we're two rounds away from winning. Let's see what happens. I don't remember. I tell him bleach shots after the game. I got the Clorox. So I see the guy to my left, but I want to make sure mid's clear. He gets the pick. I know there's a guy to the left, so I'm going to try to pick him. Look at this spray. Literally like, how many shots? Ten shots missed. That's terrible. I should have just took the time to aim instead of just sprayed wildly. Wildly. Ah, oh, it's like so frustrating watching myself play. Like I'm just not good at Counter Strike. It's not good at the game. So right now I'm pretty confident because it's a four on one, and I know he's coming over here. So I'm just gonna play in my same spot. This kid pushes him. I think he kills him. Nope, he gets wrecked. So I know I can just spray. Oh, I got wrecked. Oh, my teammates saved my life. Wow. 
All right, so we're one round away from winning. I'm 22 five, five and oh, I'm sorry. All right, I see them pushing mid and I lose because I'm bad. What's my score right now? This kid I love, Cats, is carrying the shit out of our team. Look how bad these kids are. I think they end up being like silver or something. That's why. Because I was in queue for so long. I was actually a single game in this game. So we lose this round because we're bad. Oh, my bad. Let's go back to me. They have a bot, too. So again, I try to talk everyone into rushing eggs. I'm like, we can guarantee a bomb plant. We're doing really well in A. Let's let's take it. I think I got wrecked in this round because I didn't check the corners like a derp. Look, I check here. I see him and I have my knife out like an idiot. That's me being dumb. Always check that box. You know, don't be an idiot. And then we lose, because we play dumb. This guy bought an again. Oh my god. This is a pretty much an, an eco round, and we get the, the pick on the bot, so it's they all stack B, and we have an AFK. Oh no, that's a decoy, my bad. So I'm gonna get the bomb down. I know he's in there. I'm gonna play my spot up here again. Flashbang. That guy's an auto. And we win. And I get a sick SG553 mission reward, 5 cents. So that's the best way to make 5 cents playing Counter-Strike, guys. There you go.